Hi everybody and welcome back to another video. So today I'm so excited because the new Dunch Dunch Oh my god. <laughs> the new Dutch Warm Bloods are out and ever since I saw the spoilers, I've been looking forward to this day for so long. I even debated on getting all of them because they're just so gorgeous and I've always wanted to have a collection of a breed that I get every single coat color for, but today we're only going to buy three. For sure, I think. Let's see what happens. So today, honestly, like, <laughs> there's so many people here. It's a very down day. It was super rainy out, and I swear everybody is in, like, bad moods today. So what better way to lift up the spirits than buying horses? That's, like, my motto at this point. Okay, so my computer's gonna go crazy because there's 10 million people here, but let's try to work through it. First, we have this Dapple Gray, which I know for a fact I'm going to be buying. I feel like this is a very popular horse right now. It's super cute and I already have a nickname for this horse. This is gonna be Arthur because it's my riding instructor's horse. When she was my age, she had a dapple gray just like this and his name was Arthur. <coughs> So you know what? I love naming my horses after real life horses. Look at that beautiful face. It's so cute. I feel like SSO really nailed this breed. I... my... Excuse me. Star Sable has been doing such a good job. I mean, my favorite breed in the game is the Belgian Warmblood, but you know what? This one's coming close to the Belgian Warmblood. I haven't even bought one yet. What am I even rambling about here? Okay, I think I'm gonna change to the main. <sighs> Look at that. I love me some braids. So I think this is what we're gonna do. Oh my gosh. These horses are definitely more stiff, I feel like, than others, but also I feel like that's kind of the breed as well. <laughs> So cute! Okay, they have two special movements. I love it. Um, the roach mane kind of looks cool. I'm not gonna lie. I like it, which is so weird. But I think I'm gonna do this mane. Let's see what it looks like from here. Super adorable. Love it. Okay, this is going to be an adult gelding and then his name's gonna be Arthur, but obviously I don't think there's Arthur. I don't think that's a name. I kind of want to name this horse Classy boy classy lady would be cute too but arthur is a boy <laughs> Ooh, guys i don't know what to do because i like classy lady but like classy boy this horse has to be a gelding so i'm naming it after a real life horse okay otherwise it's gonna bother me so what should i do okay you know what i'm gonna name this horse classy boy and if i want to name a horse classy lady i definitely can there's no problem with that okay so let's buy him hi sweetie oh i'm so excited oh my gosh i didn't even notice the face it has like little flea bite marks i think or something <laughs> oh stop oh he knows he's cute doesn't he we're gonna send the horses to our stable um so i'm going to be also naming this horse after my very first lesson horse this horse definitely is pretty orange but like i love it so it doesn't matter i do like the braids on him as well but i think we might do the regular mane yeah okay we're gonna do the regular one. It's just, this is like crazy how accurate this horse is to my first lesson horse ever. So his name is Boomer and I didn't think they had a Boomer. <laughs> um, Fox. I kind of like Foxtail. I don't know. We could do Fox Hunter. Kind of like that Fox Hunter. So this is gonna be Fox Hunter, also known as Boomer. We'll send him to stable. And then for the last one, which one do you think I'm gonna buy? Yep, we're gonna buy this one. I think this is a seal bay. Correct me if I'm wrong. I know they said, but I kind of forgot. I don't have a horse like this, so I think it's perfect. Since I already bought two boys, I think it's time for a girl. So I've always wanted to nickname a horse Dahlia, and I think that'd be so cute for this one. Horse braids look so good. Oh my gosh, the little booty. <laughs> Aw, okay. I th <laughs> she looks bold right now. I cannot do that to her. Okay, I think I'm gonna keep the regular mane. Wait, I called this mane regular and it's definitely not the regular mane style. This is the regular one. Okay, perfect. So this is Dahlia and I think I'm gonna name her Double Trouble because that's the saying. And it starts with a D, so it'll make me remember that her name is Dahlia. Yeah, adult mare. Hi, sweetheart. 
Okay, so we're gonna also send her to stable and now for my favorite part we're going to line them up and analyze them and ride them i'm so excited also i'm training my arabian right now i bought him because the arabians are going away and i've always wanted this horse i also bought another arabian yep i bought another gen 1 arabian are we surprised no the Arabians will always have a special place in my heart. If anything, I prefer the Gen 1 Arabians over the Gen 2. Okay, so first off, let me show you guys the Arabian that I caved and bought. This is Winterbell, and I named her after Alice Winterbell because the OGs know that she was an inspiration to all of us, for sure. So yeah, I had to buy her. And also, I think that these two are gonna be a cute little couple together. <laughs> I don't know, okay? If you guys don't know already, I kind of like, I don't actually actively roleplay in my stable, believe it or not. I mean, I guess, believe what you want. I don't though, but I like to make up little scenarios in my head. So these two are together and they're dating. I just decided that right now. Anyways, so we have Double Trouble, Classy Boy, and Fox Hunter. This is Fox Hunter, also known as Boomer. Oh my. Oh my gosh! Ah! Goodness gracious, this horse is beautiful. I'm obsessed with this one. Well, it's so shiny and I just love it. I love it so much. And then we have Classy Boy. Oh, Classy Boy, also known as Arthur. Oh, I'm so glad I went with the braids. It looks so cool with the mane. So then we have Double Trouble, also known as Dahlia. You guys, I'm extremely indecisive. Listen. Maybe I should keep the theme that all of these horses are lesson horses because I have Arthur, I have Boomer, which are real life horses. And then I just remembered that a long time ago, that's why I kind of forgot. I used to ride a horse that was a seal bay named Cricket. He was super skittish, so he went off to a better home, I think. I don't, I really don't remember, but maybe I can name him Cricket after him. I think we're gonna do that. I think this is gonna be my lesson horse bunch here. So let's change Double Trouble into a gelding. And this is now Cricket, not Dahlia. False alarm, everybody. This is what happened. This is what goes through my head when I buy horses, and you guys are just here to listen. <laughs> well, let's take a picture of these cutie patooties. I'm obsessed with them. Okay, guys, which one should I ride first? <gasps> okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna close my eyes, and then I'm gonna put my cursor on whatever one I want to buy. But first, let me, like, move around. Let me spin. Okay, I, I swear I have my eyes closed right now, and I don't know if I'm facing the right way. Hopefully we are, and I pick... This one. I'm faced forward now. I don't know. Okay. I'm gonna pick this one. Oh, Cricket! Okay, this outfit definitely is not gonna look good with him, but it's okay. I love the nickname Dahlia though, so I guess we'll just have to save that for a different horse. Yay. I don't know about you guys, but some horses are more fun for me to ride than others. And it has to do a lot with what the horse looks like from the back. I'm not talking about the butt. I'm talking about like the gallop, you know? I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Um, these are perfect dressage horses, which is so fun. I didn't even look at the other colors, you guys. <laughs> I'm a terrible YouTuber, but I really like the canner. This one's a little weird, I'm not gonna lie. I don't really know what's going on. I obviously can't see the special movements, so we'll just have to wait. Oh, I'm gonna go to the manor and I'm gonna look at the other colors. Okay, we need a song. I've been obsessed with this song. It's a TikTok song, okay? It doesn't even say any words, but anyways. <laughs> That was so unnecessary, but all right. Here's the black. It's very cute, but you know what? There's just nothing special going on. It's a really pretty black though. Like if I had to pick a black horse to ride and to buy, I would pick this one. Clean and shiny and I love Kata's outfit. Kata, whatever. This one is super different. Oh, I think this is the liver chestnut. It's very different. I feel like there's not another horse like this in Star Stable, so maybe I'll buy it someday. And then we have the dapple bay i think yeah i want this horse now okay um <laughs> i really want this horse now oh geez yeah i'm buying it i don't really care this is gonna be dahlia 
holy impulsiveness. I'm gonna do the short mane. And it's going to be a mare and then... Mm, okay, I think we're gonna do cherry blossom. Here goes my star coins. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hi, Zalia. Star Sable, like, don't ever release such a good horse breed ever again, and we'll be cool. So worth it. I cannot believe I just fought four horses today. We need to go home right now. It's actually just genuinely so expensive. Star Queens are crazy expensive. It just pains me a little bit, just a little tiny bit. I'm so happy I'm paying for a game that I love, but also I'm, um, like, that's just so money but it's okay oh so cute Ooh, it's a... <laughs> you oh i'm so glad i bought dahlia like she might be my favorite coat that i bought so far and i wasn't even planning on buying her comment down below what your favorite color was from this release and i can't wait for sso to release more colors too i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in my next one Bye.